Hey, thanks for choosing Student Phase Smart Lecturing. In this video, you would be learning about transistors and their types, BJT construction, and about unbiased BJT. We all might have seen transistors in circuit boards, but we may not have recognized it as transistors. Most common type of transistors look like these. A transistor is a resistor or a semiconductor device. It can amplify electrical signals as they are transferred through it. Transistors are three terminal devices base, emitter, and collector. These terminals are used to operate in three different configurations common base, common emitter, and common collector, where the common terminals are grounded. Coming on to the types of transistors, there are two types. Unipolar junction transistor or UJT and bipolar junction transistor or BJT. In UJT, current is conducted only due to majority charge carriers. Whereas in BJT, current is conducted by both type of charge carriers, that is majority and minority charge carriers. BJTs are current controlled devices since output current is controlled by the input current. Different types of BJT are NPN type and PNP type. Construction of a transistor along with diode, equivalent circuit and its circuit diagram is as shown. When a transistor is formed by sandwiching a single N region between two P region is called PNP transistor and when a transistor is formed by sandwiching a single P region between two N region is called NPN transistor. The middle region is the base region and is lightly doped. The remaining two regions are emitter and collector which are highly doped. Doping level of emitter is slightly higher than that of collector. The collect region area is slightly larger than the emitter. The diode representation of a transistor is as shown and is nothing but two PN diodes connected back to back. There are two junctions in a transistor. One junction is between emitter and base called emitter base junction. The other junction is between the base and collector called collector base junction. The arrowhead which are these represent the flow of conventional current which is always opposite to the flow of electrons. That means in this transistor electrons flow in this direction and conventional current flow in this direction. Now let's know more about unbiased BJTs which means Connected with no external voltage supplies, as shown in the diagram. They have a depletion region at both the emitter and collector junctions, as transistors are made of 2 pn junction diodes. Depletion region in emitter and collector is small, since they are heavily doped and is large at the base. Since it is lightly doped, Collector is slightly less doped when compared to emitter, and hence, it has a higher depletion region when compared to emitter. Barrier voltage exists within transistors and is about 0.7 volts and 0.3 volts for silicon and germanium transistors, respectively. This concludes the video. Thanks for watching.